This week, our high school red zone kickoff spotlights Blue Ridge High. The Fighting Tigers take on the Greer Yellow Jackets tonight. At Blue Ridge, one of the players' greatest supporters won't let a disability hold back her spirit. Christine Scarpelli and Ryan Goodman have her story. At just 16 years old, Maggie Warner is brave. I don't know what the heck I was doing. She has guts to do something many high school girls wouldn't dare do. Weird. It's going to be like all weird. At first, maybe, but after just a okay. couple weeks, there we go. Maggie decided she wouldn't let fear hold her down as she started classes at a brand new school. <laughs> or spina bifida hold her back from fitting in. And so I met with her just to see, you know, what she wanted out of her high school experience here. Yeah, where do you want me? Maggie's teacher, Miss Susie, leads the special education class at Blue Ridge High. She helps Maggie focus on school work or if she needs some help getting around. Her daughter Taylor is on the cheer team. It was kind of like at a point in the season where we were like struggling. With Taylor says the girls were tired after months of games and competitions, but then her mom brought up bringing Maggie into the mix. And not everybody gets a chance to be on a team like ours. Yeah. So why not extend that? To Maggie, why not? And it just clicked really easily. I had no idea that this was even possible. So just like that, Maggie was on the team, but now she had to get caught up. And what better way to do that? Had to jump right in with her first game. Before last week, Maggie had not only never been to a Tigers game, she'd never seen any football game yeah. of any kind. Ever. <laughs> and her first experience was on the track with us. I have a couple videos that um, I took at the last game, so if I start practicing, I can hopefully be able to cheer with them by Friday. Under the lights against their rival Greer, Maggie says she'll give it her all, not just for her team. So if she can do this, then they can do these things too. But also for those still searching. Don't be afraid to do it. Just go out there and try your best. And if you don't make it, there's always next time. For a way to show their spirit. For photographer Ryan Goodman and Christine Scarpelli, 7 News. Be sure to watch 7 News tonight at 11 for the complete high school red zone wrap up with Pete Yannity and turn over to the Carolinas CW62 for more coverage at 1135.